week ago. It was Valentine's Day, so I hope everyone had a good Valentine's Day, a good Valentine's week, a wonderful day. Um, and if you didn't have your own Valentine's Day, I hope, uh, like, a what meant to relate to, but I hope you and a friend of yours or a family member or you were your own Valentine. Um, wanted to do the video the day after Valentine's Day. Or, I don't know, the sooner than now, but couldn't wait any longer. Not everything I wanted or needed for the video came in the mail yet. But this is video me talking and showing y'all what I got for Valentine's Day in 2019. Well, I got Valentine's Day 2019. What else we got? Um, not a lot. Uh, a few things I got myself Valentine's Day because I was like, yes. But um, for the time, uh, I ordered me some stuff in the mail. One was got here like days after I affected to, and then the two things that not came yet. One which is a unicorn ring that was so cheap on eBay. To normally that ring in particular is like forty, fifty, thirty, or something like that dollars. But on eBay, I found it's like two. But I found out recently that I'm not. If I look back on who I got it from, or I look back on it, and apparently I may not get it until May or something like that. Like, I may not get it until like um, March, whatever next month is. I might get it next month or something like that. And it's like, okay, so. Um, and then there's like an amethyst I ordered myself. Um, and that hasn't come in the mail yet, and apparently, like I said, ship within three to four business days. It's been over a week, because it was the, like, day before Valentine's Day. Um, maybe two weeks, I don't know, but, like, and then I read, and, and the description was like that, and it said it might take, like, 10, 15 days, or 15, 20 days, or something like that. So I might get it later in the middle of the day, or tomorrow, or next week, or whenever I do. Um, but it's not here. So I'll just show you what I got myself, and what other people got me, and hopefully later on in the video, have a wonderful, lovely message, and stuff. Good, wonderful vibe from you yeah, are truly a wonderful uh, unicorn, favorite unicorn, tiny elf unicorn, short little unicorn that I am. Uh, and I'm going to show you. First, I'm going to talk about what I forgot, which I feel like, okay, I got me some stuff and then I got stuff from other people. So I feel like almost anything I bought myself in January and February, which considered a fancy gift for me to myself. It's a, I don't know, but first, I got like over a month ago for Valentine's Day, this cute, adorable card for Dougie on it that says, a better delivery of love to you on Valentine's Day, and it's like, dearest, and it said my name, and it said who it's from, adorable, like how fluffy, yes, I was just like happy to see this, so fluffy, you know, they had little envelope pot thing, cute little fluffy dogs, I love fluffy dogs the most. And then I got this mirror also from the same person, you know, over a month ago, around a month ago. Cute hot mirror, which I have kind of been dreaming of having a mirror like that for, like, a little bit before I actually got it. Wanted it, and it's like, how many people have not? How many people have been wanting a mirror like this? I didn't tell anyone to ask. I got the mirror that I wanted a mirror like that. Like, I don't really use it. Kind of look at it sometimes, and I'm like, eh. But I do like it. It's cute, but it's like my reflection. It's okay. But... Let me get to the other stuff I can. Okay. Then, from an aunt of mine, aunt of mine, I got these fluffy things because she saw it. And she thought of me and so she had to get it for me. Look, at, look, look. Is there something tiny? Oh, yes. It's hot pink. I think it's hot pink. I don't know. Dog pink. Monkey. With a little bow tie. Cause I like bows and bow ties. He's all from fancy. Oh, yes. Um, and he had like kitty hands I can put on my stuff. 
Usually I have him on a uh, calendar that friends got me for Christmas. He just he's on the same he's on the same uh nail or thumbtack that that's on. And he just yeah. So he's on my wall. The usually that's why I'll see. The first thing I I, I I got myself, which I got over a month ago, about a month ago. So y'all if y'all watch my videos, I don't know. Seen it's um this. This was it's five dollars. And this was uh, I thought this would be like pretty much the only thing I ordered for myself. For the most part. If I found it, so I was like, do I need, do I need? And I was like, yeah, okay, it's so cheap and you want and it would wrap around plastic, like it wouldn't you know, like anyone ever touched it after pale, like I don't know ever like had to touch it. Um it was wrapped around plastic and stuff, so clean. It did cool. Uh it's not lavender, sadly, so it doesn't really match my bed, but it is a lilac, I think. No, 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 the flower name. It has pink cheeks and star for eyes. Look at that, it's sparkly, so my aesthetic and stuff. Um, a friend of mine, I was like, to usually every year if I'm not mentally to but I don't have any a partner or whatever to be Valentine. Usually, last year, I'm like, a friend could be my Valentine. So last year, my best friend was, I got him a chocolate rose with a theme with plastic. And then this year he didn't want me to get him the same thing, and he's like, I don't really want you to get me anything. And so I decided that a friend of ours was going to be my Valentine's dad, so I'm like, I'll be this. I also got her a panda hello, which has the same this, and it's that small. And also then, like, a rainbow glue gun glue thing for a dollar. So technically, I was her Valentine. Um, and that was, like, back in January, like, a month ago. Um, yes. This is cute. I should have stopped here and this be the only thing I got myself for Valentine's Day or around that time, but it wouldn't. Um, I almost bought me this because of unicorn and, it, and I was like, oh, I need to get, I need this myself. I want it. I want to buy me some chocolate. Even though it's not dark chocolate, so I prefer dark chocolate. It's white chocolate. But it's still good with this. I almost got me this myself. But luckily, I didn't have to. Someone else got it for me. Kind of like I picked it out myself. I picked it out, but like, it is cuddly cutie, yummy, milky, and chocolatey candy. Um, you can get like, uh, cause you got a dog, a pen, a polar bear, an owl, a raccoon, a frog, or a unicorn. But the only one I really saw was the unicorn and the owl. Cause the owl was behind the unicorn. I didn't really check, but I saw the unicorn, I was like, I had to get this for myself, but I didn't, so when I was got it for me, along with this unicorn thing, that I saw when they were checking out, and Dr. Pepper, which I drank, because I, uh, I had to hold myself off from eating this, so I wanted to, so I got to eat it, to chocolate and cute, but I was like, no, I want to do a video, so the way for everything I got for Valentine's Day, I mean, like the stuff I ordered and other stuff. I'm still waiting on. Oh well, but yeah. So like Dr Pepper and these two things, I got. I got cute unicorn theme as usual. That's why I'm wearing this unicorn hoodie because I was like it's kind of Valentine-y with a heart on it. It's cute. Yeah, and I was like, before making the video, I thought so many times while well, gonna wear it, and I was like, you know what? I just just wear this. I have so many like moon hoodie, at, uh, hoodie I call my hippie hoodie that's pink and black and stuff. I have other stuff that look more cutesy and Valentiney and stuff. I was like, nah, it's, it's unicorn. It goes with my my username. Um, so yeah, cute. So like you know the, the theme. Oh my god, just like in my uh, my uh, when my friend got me for Christmas, there's always the theme of unicorn. That's always the theme. That's always the theme. It's like, it's like kind of like Debbie thought. It's like, hello, back to my channel. Except it's not a mirror. It's not. It's it's a it's a pin. It's a pin. Oh, bibbly bobbly boop. Bibbly. It's like my unicorn fairy. Some of that. Boop boop boop. Bibbly bobbly boop. Um. And then. Okay, I ordered me some stuff from Epsi. I ordered me, I did a couple things, but one of them, with the amethyst, uh, I ordered, 
had not come in yet, but like a month or so ago, I ordered me a mystery box from FC from My Damn and Postcard, and I got this bracelet I've been wearing a bunch that said Dream on it. This is from a uh, mystery box I got from FC that was five dollars, and I was only supposed to get one thing from it, but I got a uh, this cute bracelet. I got a bobby pin. And I got in this cute adorable box, which if y'all seen my Mickey XC box by the all the video it's in it. I got these pink uh crescent moon earrings. Which is cute. So I think they're like backward made, like the the, to the crescent moon is supposed to be on the front, like in front of the pink. But it's behind it. Cause I'm, but yeah, it's these. Let me go get the, the pin, the like bobby pin thing. Came with it, it's not a normal bobby pin, there's something on it. Hey, go right back. Okay, so with the bracelet and earrings on top of the package, like with the bow they made, or she made, did you see, I think. Um, there was this with, on it. So, technically, I got this too cute bobby pin. So, the last thing I wrote from FC for Valentine's Day didn't came in yet, sadly. But, these were the kind of made backward, like, because I'm pretty sure the moon is supposed to be in front of the sea. So, then you'll know the sea, because it's not the, the moon, not the sea, the crescent moon. Cause if not, you don't see it, like, but what I will do with, oh, I get it, it's cute, look at, look how cute, and that, these are what came with the mystery $5 Epsi box that I ordered for myself for like, kind of like a Valentine's gift thing, but since the pink, and I wasn't expecting it to be pink, so since the pink and had like the moon and dream and stuff, which, moon, dream, kind of go hand in hand, I guess, this, Cute, but yeah. Um, I'll put that on there later, I guess. But I've been wearing it for like a few days in a row or so. Been wearing it, it's kind of cute. Okay, it's something where you're like, oh, it's cute. But now it's something I wear, but then you, you do end up wearing it. Um, So yeah, I ordered me an amethyst and then a, a unicorn ring and the male one on Epsi one on eBay. I hadn't got those in mail yet, but I was hoping before I filmed me the video I would, but I didn't. But yeah, I got that mirror, heart mirror, I got this. Like, let me just... Like that mirror. Okay, I'm no, oh, I almost forgot something that did came in the mail. Okay, so I have a friend who both day was on Valentine's Day, so I got them a candle, like the X and O candle from Facebook Jewel that had like marker with, so you can like it's like a dry erase board with the candle holder mail or something like that, so you can draw on it and have the ring inside. So I got all that, but then I also ordered myself a bath bomb. Which I'm still trying to edit the video because like I couldn't film the whole thing, but I have the majority of the bath bomb dissolving and busy and stuff being cool and turning the bath water into purple and gray and then like the ring from it and stuff. I'm still editing, trying to figure out how to make a video for that. But I got the, I got favorite jewels, the, the life intention. You can only get the love, the colored one. Love is. Purple and gray bath bombs that loved carved, like loved on it, and then the other one's the code and the blue and gray, I think. Um, I got the love one, and I wanted the one that said enough, I am enough, or the one that said I am love, because they have a message on the bottom, and it's like you buy this, you give like a girl a day of school, and something like that. Um, these were offensive bath bombs, at least to me it was, but it was something I really wanted, but I'm not looking at it on the website for like a month or so. So, finally got it, and the ring I got from it was the one that said, I am loved, which 
I didn't know with the ring was the one that said I am love until now. So I wanted, I did want to like a teardrop shape one with like the shake different design. This one says I am love. I don't know if you can see that, but on the bottom, which it says the side between it, the, the bottom, not side, it says I am love. And it has this, like this is what it looked like. Sorry, my nails look bad. And it was value at $25, like the code said $25, and I got 25 dollars, 25 points. Um, yeah. So I got me a bath bomb and a front of candle. And I think cause I got a fall, the, the fall code. But there was an extra code in the um, box, but it was in the box of the candle for my friend. So I let her have that code. So I was like, why is there a code? On top of the wrapping of the candle and not in, but in pizza, there's also a code with the ring. But whatever, she so get two codes. So they have. And the thing is about Fangle Jewels, yeah, most of the ring, like, you get a really expensive, limited time ring, whatever. Um, so those come with 9 to 5 stolen silver rings, I think. Most of the ring, like, almost all the rings are not that, they're just another material. But thing is, like usually you order, you can come like like oftentimes get a free wing for your order, and also like size you can pick your size. So cute. So this I got me a wing because I'm in love. So I used to have a button that my little sister gave me because she didn't want anymore. That was like a bottle cap button thing. It said I'm loved and I had it back in high school and it was on my backpack one day and then. It wasn't anymore, so something happened to it, and then I used to make a joke saying, I'm not loved anymore, I guess I'm not loved anymore, that's why I don't have that button anymore, I don't know, it's a joke. But hey, now that ring say I'm loved, so I'm loved, as I was before I got the ring, but side the point, she can see it says something. And in fact, it said, I am loved, like patent, so patent, I'm loved. Um, I wear my Moonstone right now, but it doesn't really seem like a ring that goes on that finger. It may be on, like, the ring finger, but too big for a ring finger. It is made with Swati crystals, uh, and then there's something to do with opals. It goes to, like, give you good intentions, help soothe you. The smell note for that bomb was, like, jasmine. Um, musk, wood, something, like some guy sounding scents, a couple of them, and then others with like full, full scents and stuff, and jasmine and stuff like that. But overall, a good bath bomb. It did look kind of pricey to me for bath bomb, but it was a really good bath bomb. It fizzled good, if that makes sense. Still working on the video, so I might post a video for the bath bomb just came in and stuff. But yeah. Hot, hot. So yeah, the so so far this month, one hour of big things I order came in, but oh well. I'm sure I'll show you in a later video about the other things I got. Sadly, I can't see the amethyst I bought me. If you yeah, know I'm a fan of amethyst, but uh, yeah. Cute. Um, and it came like when it was in the uh, bath bomb. It came in this cute little clear ball. Cute. Got a. So the self following like I got either ten or twenty five dollars worth of um, the wings. I think. Yeah, you, know, you have a chance to win a ten thousand dollar wing and three peg. But mostly, if you get a wing from there, I'm pretty sure it's only gonna be ten or twenty five. If you want one that value more, and you want one that may have a nine two five total silver, bet to probably like. Go look at one of the other companies that had like bath bombs and candles that bring inside them and look and see and do some research and find which one that mostly 9 to 5 don't only silver rings. But if you don't care if it don't only silver 9 to 5 or not, you don't care, like your skin not nice into stuff mine, you don't care. This, yeah, and, and you want cute candles and stuff, that's good. And Frank with yours is for you. Um, so, other than the two things I ordered, 
You didn't get and then dot for avoiding. I got this ring. This is I'm love. I got a few unicorn things. He has like two and four on the back, but like from my mama to me and it says you are magical and the unicorn has pink hair and it's white. Yes. Yes. Cute. I don't want a unicorn and I would have like told in the owl. Pretty cute. Yep. Cause the dog not Dodson, so but yeah. And this what I got from an FC box, a box from FC, um, and then that cute, it's the cute mirror that I like that Bobby needed to clean. That's what I got for Valentine's Day. Um, I was in fact my own Valentine. Um, Valentine's Day I woke up to a bunch of messages from two of my friends being like, I love you, and it was mostly like sounding a little ghetto what they were saying to me, but like a bunch of messages, short sort of messages here and there, it's like, I love you, and let me just read it out loud. What they sent me. Someone texting me and me online. And it was really cute and sweet to wake up to message. I'm like, no, I, I didn't wake up to a love note or message from like a crush or a love interest, a spouse, a boyfriend, girlfriend, whatever. I didn't, but I did woke up to nice, cute texts. From two of my friends being like, Happy Valentine's Day, love you, cute things like that. Um, this is really cute stuff. It's nice to wake up to, even if it's like, not by like a love interest or like a partner or whatever. To, to woke up to friends, people that love you, texting you things, really nice and amazing to wake up to. It was just so amazing to look up to wonderful message from people that love me and amazing. Um, but that day I spent it by working on a tone paper and other assignment, but mostly a tone paper. I did later on went out to eat at a restaurant that not like a food chain or thing. It did right now. It's in the town I live in. It's the only location of it. Let me read you so I can't find messages from my best friend, but I can find from the other friend that messaged me. Okay, it, it, I don't message every day like this. Okay. It was like, okay, so I woke up to Happy Valentine's Day, love you, and then some letters in the world was like, You're amazing, kind, beautiful, gay, but strong, lovable, and super sweet, like chocolate, roses, and stuff. Happy, ever loving. And it's just a V word. Day, Valentine's, love you, FGT, then she said beep, ASS, lavender, loving, and then she said another word that I'm not gonna say, and I was like, love you too, unicorn love, and then she put a hot purple, and I put a bunch of like purple hearts and unicorns, that was from one of my friends, and the other one sent stuff close to that, was like, have Valentine's Day, love you, stuff like that, and so it's wonderful to get, wonderful to wake up. Two wonderful messages like that. I do really appreciate it and love it. And when I had yesterday, I gave my friend who her birthday was on Valentine's Day, I gave her her, her present and she loved it. I don't know if she started burning the candle yet, but so far she liked it. And she had never gotten a candle that had it's like a wing inside of it yet, so she's really excited for that. Um, this year, Valentine's Day was good. Last year, my best friend was my Valentine's Day. Uh, Few years, like over a few years ago, another guy from mine was my Valentine. He got me flowers, one roses, flowers, and like a uh, Amazon tea. Not Amazon, um, whatever that tea called, maybe something else. Um, yeah. Like I never had like a romantic, like never been in a relationship during Valentine's Day, but last year I was talking to someone. I had like a couple of people, like, Someone asked to be my Valentine, I was like, no, and then someone else I was talking to, and they were kind of mean, and we were like, oh, we each other Valentine's Day, but we didn't get into anything, we didn't really even know each other, and then, this year someone did ask me on Valentine's Day to be the Valentine, I was like, don't really know you, but sure, like, I saw that person, sure, so technically I did have Valentine this year, because I had two of my friends, and then, I guess, a random person, and then, like, I got stuff from my mom, I got a, 
Um, my stuff sister gave me a little bit of candy because it was some rainbow candy. So it's like, yeah, no, Miho kind of like she gave it to me, but she kept eating some of it, so I kind of got something from her. But yeah, I got Valentine's for myself because I am a normal Valentine and always will be. Yes, I got stuff for myself, for my mom, for my aunt. I got messages from friends, and it's wonderful. Good Valentine to the um, don't do the message. <laughs> Sometimes you get to spoil yourself or treat your own self. Don't overdo it, I guess. Love yourself. And, you know, if you don't have a best of someone on Valentine's Day, that's okay. Just make a pack of friends or with a friend or, like, do a thing with a friend. And y'all each other Valentine's Day. Y'all just hang out at Valentine's Day together. Or get each other something cute and tiny and sweet. Or, you know, if you don't, or, or not do that, get yourself something. Because there was someone I was talking to, you, like, on Snapchat or like that. And they, just like me, had the same idea to just treat themselves Valentine's Day, give themselves something for Valentine's Day, and they did. And we were talking about how that's good, and like, best to do and stuff. So it's like, you don't, you're not less than who you are, or less of a person because you choose to be single, or because you're single, doesn't mean you're ugly, or bad, or you're never gonna be loved. It's just, right now, like, if you believe in God, right now, God is working on your love story. Just, just be patient. It should be, hopefully, it's both in the end. Um, I right now is totally single. Like I talk to a lot of people I do. I'm just I had so many people that just wanted to get in my pants or pretty much or they want like a friend of benefit type of thing or they wanted a side chick or like someone to hook up with sometimes or just a one night stand. I had people who they thought I should go to their place, like go to their house, even if even if I didn't know them. Whatever, I had people who basically stringed me along and I thought we were dating or going to, and then they didn't. I had so many people that wouldn't take no, even if, like, you know, like, about the most stupid things. Um, people get mad because I wouldn't date them. There was someone who lived in a div uh, the next day over, I mean, you know, we're talking to Mallory, man, I'm. And I told them, they were like, oh, we're going to be friends, and they're not friends, that's cool. And then they're talking to me, and they want to date me, and they have me out. And I was like, no, I tried a long digital link to before, and it didn't work out. And plus, we never even met before. I tried a long digital link to last year, didn't really work out. I, it wasn't like too long distance, but that person wanted me, they, they were like, oh, I promise I'll be in town, like, every other weekend. And then they wasn't, and then they, so, I don't know, those times where they would go, they'd go talk to me, and then, I don't know what to do with it. Like, I wasn't like to, but at the same time, I wasn't last year. Love me. I don't know. Uh, this. <sighs> so much stuff. And a lot of time, lane trip is more dharma than worth. And I'm. Unlike a lot of people, I don't want to go from a lane trip to a lane trip. Like, go from a breakup to, like, like I don't need that. Like. You know what I mean? Like. I don't know. Like. It's not like I believe in Disney movies and Lifetime movies. Like a lot of time, I am i don't believe there's someone out there out there for me. I, I do for like everyone else, basically, but not me. I don't know. Like, I am my, my soulmate. Um, but like, don't look down. There's someone for everyone. You know someone, you will find someone, and they're the only person you want to be with. Like, you could be with anyone and everyone, even people who are better looking or more talented or whatever than them, but you're going to choose them over anyone and everyone, and they're going to do the same thing. They're going to look at you, like, you put a star in the sky, stars in the sky, you're going to do the same. They're going to be your king or queen, you're going to be the king or queen or empress or whatever, you know what I mean? But they'll be into some more things than you, maybe not completely everything. You're all going to argue and fight, but it'll be worth fighting for. I believe that, you know what I mean? Because I've been, like, someone people just wanted to see for people or just whatever, and it's like, no, no, I'm, no, that's not gonna happen, like, like, I'm not like, I'm not even gonna kiss someone unless I think I'm about to be related to them or I'm in a to, you know what I mean, with that person? So, like, no, I'm definitely not gonna, no. Um, Told me I had um, to lot you to so many low points to like I wouldn't do in the best in my own class to so I had or having trouble finding a job or whatever the life wasn't what I wanted to be like and so I was like down really low myself to start talking to a bunch of guys and does feel good to talk to a bunch of people but the guy the girl the both or whatever that I'll chat to you and stuff even if a lot of the messages are kind of gross and you're like I don't even know you or the whatever um. 
kind of aggressive methods and stuff like that, it's still good to like, yeah, I, mean, I don't know, if I stop that, I don't think too lowly me. But I probably won't be willing to the next, I'm probably not, I'm still working on myself, and it's okay if you are too, it's okay to be sing single, it's okay to choose to be single. Um, sorry, you haven't seen my unicorn horn the whole time, um, it just, I know how tough it is to me, I know back in high school, I used to feel like, bad and ugly because everyone could be in relating to relate to everyone was in so many relating to but i was i had been in too many i was like and not only to i haven't been in lots of day long you know what i mean and like things but you know you're a prince you're a princess you're a queen you're a king you're empress your unicorn your whatever it will come along to you later if not then just like they will in some way. And guess what? You gotta be happy and love yourself. Be your own Valentine. Love yourself. Do something for you. Don't just feel bad just because you're like me. You didn't have like a romantic partner during Valentine's Day. You know what I mean? Like, it's kind of, Valentine, Valentine's Day kind of, it's overrated completely. Okay? And this is coming for me. It is completely overrated to, you should just like, Oh, you see something that makes you think of someone, or you know someone been wanting something, you just like, oh, you know, you gotta get your stuff, because you want to, not because it's a day, uh, like, people shouldn't feel like they have to get someone something, maybe because it's Valentine's Day or whatever, I don't know, and then they give you cheesy stuff that they probably gave to an exit to before you, I don't know, or so many other exits, um, I w was hoping that the message I gave out was better than what it actually is, but it's not, and I'm sorry, Oh my god, y'all with me like I got an interview today. Uh, I stopped having any hours at my last job, so let me get a new job. So hopefully, hopefully I'm not gonna go at this. I did put this hoodie on, this on for the video. Um, so hopefully. Oh my god, this morning I woke up, I had such good news. I looked on my YouTube notifications, sorry, and the guy for, um, I did react to a song called Pavement by a singer, songwriter, YouTuber named Say We Can Fly, uh, Brandon. Oh my god, he uh, commented on my reaction video to his new song, Pavement. Oh my god. And he commented, thank you, estimation point, estimation point, and then he commented, by the way, the lyrics are, I've got, uh, the lyric is, I got love, you can have it. And he's like, haha, smiley face. So I guess he liked my reaction video. So that is amazing to wake up and a singer, band member, YouTuber, or someone that you like, it's amazing. They see your video about them, about the song or whatever you were reacting to and stuff. And they comment on it. So that, that's amazing. So, so far this year, it's wonderful. So, a little bit of tiny drama that I guess I'm slightly a part of, but whatever, um, you know what I mean? I don't know. Back to what I was talking about, the time I feel bad, so I'm single, but then, like, there's some been people here and there that want to date me, I'm just not in a hurry. I'll get there when I get there. I'll fight, whatever, um, hopefully y'all like that too, like, no, don't worth anything. If it is worth it, if it was fighting for it, it is worth climb a mountain for whatever then um anything good would take time take patience and if it was it then you don't have to rush anything it will all come into place sooner or later if it was it it will happen will be no rush take time you know what i mean don't don't rush into anything because like the faster and earlier you are too you might get faster to, well, not earlier and faster you are to marriage, you might faster you are to divorce. And, I don't know. But, the video is really way too long. I'm sorry. I just had, like, talk, talk about Valentine and relationship. Plus, what I got for Valentine's Day and self love. Always have self love and respect for yourself. Yes, don't get into a relationship just to be in a relationship or because your family and friends think you should be or because everyone else seems to be in a relationship and stuff. Just, you did. Haven't found that one for you yet. You just not in that position, that place, like other people are. Because that place is different for you than everyone is. Um, 
But yes, unicorn love and rainbow kisses. Unicorn hugs and rainbow kisses. Unicorn love and rainbow kisses. I'm sorry this video is so long and that I don't have everything I wanted for this video to show y'all. But, you know, this has to do with self-love and stuff like that. And the Valentine doesn't always have to be, like, romantic partner or mental, uh, love interest or anything like that. It could be yourself, could be friends, could be family. Heck, your animal could be your Valentine. Technically, my rat, Frank, with my Valentine. Cause I gave him a treat. I was like, I love you, Frank. You'll be my Valentine. He looked at me, gave me a kiss on the finger, and he was like, yes. So, that, that was lame. But, yeah. Um... Hopefully they give a good message. Sorry, this video is so long. Yes. Um. So yeah, you can love and rainbow kisses. Meow, meow, meow. Bye.